Hi, it's me, the Emery Goddess. Uh, just an update. Um, sorry, this is why I'm updating. The medication change that the doctor uh, from the hospital, which I'm going to be seeing as an inpatient sometime in the next 10 weeks, is going well. I'm experiencing some side effects which uh, are manageable. Some medication is going up, some is going down, so I can feel a significant difference in my body. Oh, sorry. <sighs> Holding the phone is... Okay. okay. So this morning, it's a beautiful day here. Um, I'm in bed completely, apart from toilet stops, which tend to... Use a penny spoons that I've got. Um, but this morning, the children were able to, because winter here in New Zealand, children were able to go outside to do some yard work. Um, it was lovely, and my bedroom window faces straight onto the front yard, so. It's quite a large window and so we opened the curtains and I was watching the children work and it was really lovely and I was feeling very content um, and then I had a crash, I like spaced out, couldn't speak, pain, right through the right side of my body, and it just, I couldn't put a sentence together or access my words. And nausea and just pain it was like I was in my body but I couldn't move my body I've never had a reaction like that to light um, it was as extreme as I've ever felt so we've So we've closed the curtains again and I can't, I can't see outside. <sighs> but I feel better. I can speak again. I can hear them. And they're, uh, they're laughing. There's light coming through my curtains, but with my sunglasses on, I can manage it. I can hear what they're doing. I just can't see them. <laughs> so, okay, it's shit. It's shit, shit, shit. But... My pain is manageable again. I can speak. I can move. I am amazed that just that bright light. It was. It was like the light was a weapon, and I had no defense against it, and I never. Have felt that way before. I've had 
sound and light sensitivity before but I've never been I've never been um, affected quite so dramatically I don't know if it's from the medication change or it just it's a day you know this isn't my normal and so there's a I guess my body and my brain are coping with the medication changes chemical changes and adding adding light to the scenario has uh, overloaded my my brain and my body in some way I don't think this will stick around I think it's just now but I needed to record it I'm gutted oh. you see the children are outside with honey cleaning up the yard as a birthday gift because it's my birthday in a couple of weeks <laughs> And I've always wanted. <coughs> Sorry, this is getting me nowhere. I've always wanted a scented garden out the front. Because of our situation, we haven't been able to landscape or anything like that. So they were tidying things up to try and plant some pretty scented flowers outside my window. So I could enjoy them. This better not stick around or I'm going to be so pissed off. Uh, nothing is going to stand between me and my babies. And nothing is going to stand in the way of me being able to really appreciate that gift in the way it was meant. So... I'm upset and I'm afraid but I'm also seriously pissed off and this is not going to stay I have mind over matter Can work then that's got to become my new superpower because I'm not gonna live like this I don't know how I'm gonna do it I don't know how I'm gonna do it but I'm gonna do it I'm gonna see the gift enjoy the gift that my babies are outside right now working so hard on and it's gonna be okay and I'm gonna be able to to see it and I'm going to be able to experience that gift with them and that's that so I got a fright I felt vulnerable but I've got tools Hey, if the Blues Brothers can wear sunglasses at night and be cool, so can I. Okay, I'm calm now. Right now. So. going to give this mind over matter thing a bit of a, 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 a bit of a... a a bit of a bash. Be calm. Get your shit together. Crikey girl. Get your shit together. I can manage the pain. I've got my body back. I can talk. I don't feel quite as sick. Yeah. 
I wish I could remember that line from the Bruce Brothers. It's like, oh, it's so classic. The, the, the something and something, it's night and we're wearing sunglasses and it's like, yeah. Give this a bash. But it was a new experience, a vivid new experience and because I never remember anything, I thought I'd be stunned. I capture it, but I had to wait until I was back in control of my arms and legs. And my brain had reconnected itself to my mouth. So, I guess, uh, yeah, that's my update. Oh, gosh. Oh, my. Sorry. My hand's getting tired. It's probably time to go. Right. Well, for now, it's the Emmy Goddess signing off. Until hopefully next time. I won't be such a sucky bubba. Okay. Toodles for now.